Hey baddies, so it's your girl Bevy, and on this channel we talk about hair growth and hair loss, the science of them both, they're not the same, stop using them interchangeably. But a lot of my baddies are new here, so let me just give you a quick little background, and then we're gonna go right into the video. So your girl has 10 plus years of experience in the pharmaceutical and healthcare industries. I understand drug pharmacology, I understand product formulations, I understand clinical studies. This is what I do, okay? And on this channel, I just take all that information and put it in a blender, and then I just put it, give it to you in little bite-sized pieces. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> So anyway, there is a star ingredient that's been on the scene for a long time, but in skincare. And I'm just here to put y'all on because this is that girl when it comes to hair care. And her name is Hyaluronic Acid. So the letter of the day, baddies, is H for hydration, okay, and for hyaluronic acid. The bottom line is when you guys need hydration, I don't care if you low porosity, high porosity, whatever porosity you got going on, okay, hyaluronic acid is the only thing you need to really hydrate your hair now I've noticed that there's videos on how to you know moisturize train or hydrate train I don't know what none of that stuff means all I know is that if you have a hard time getting anything to penetrate the shaft of your lovely hair then you need hyaluronic acid because when I'm telling you hyaluronic acid is gonna open the door the floodgates I'm saying, okay, if you know what I mean. Anyway, so for those of y'all who live under a rock, which I know you don't, because if you're here watching this, you're on YouTube and you know everything, but it's just one or two people. So let me speak to the one or two. Hyaluronic acid basically is a natural occurring substance that happens in your body and it holds up to a thousand times its weight. What does that mean in English? It means that hyaluronic acid is just designed to basically carry a whole boatload of water. So let's look at hyaluronic acid like it's a bucket. It's a big bucket that carries a whole Whole bunch of water it's like the biggest bucket you can get you know what I'm saying there's other things there's other humectants and a humectant basically is a hydrating agent that not only hydrates but it absorbs it pretty much turns all the moisture and everything out it pulls moisture from the atmosphere and it hydrates so if you imagine it pulling moisture from the atmosphere then imagine that being hyaluronic acid hyaluronic acid is the biggest bucket so you got honey which is a bucket it's a nice size bucket you got squalene which is another size bucket Bucket, right you got glycerin which is a good size bucket but you got hyaluronic acid you know what I'm saying that's how much hydration your girl is getting with hyaluronic acid okay so why they use it in skincare they use it in skincare to keep their skin plump their face plump is is really great for anti-aging right it's like the anti-aging goat because it's gonna give you that plump youthful look so for those of y'all who don't have a lot of face fat but for those of y'all who getting wrinkles and your face always look dry you need to start getting you some products with hyaluronic acid it, but this is not a skincare video okay now I can do those but you know the algorithm like when I talk about hair so here we are okay so now like I said it's a humectant that's gonna draw air hair is going to draw moisture or attract moisture right to your hair shaft and so let's look at it the analogy of it is as a huge behind bucket that can hold up to a thousand times its weight okay that's why we're using that so basically why is hydration amazing because we know hydration for your hair is obviously gonna plump your hair is gonna give your hair more body we don't think about that right think about the cells right think about the cells in your hair think about the cells in the shaft it's going to plump your hair it's gonna give it more volume it's gonna make it look shinier you know when you have dry brittle hair it's because it's dry duh so when you have that cornflakes hair it's gonna go in and it's gonna give you that shiny beautiful I mean just that glowing girl okay girl people be like oh what you mix with they be like girl what you mix with what you you, know, you Spanish you Indian you this and that I be like girl I mix with hyaluronic acid girl and water okay but anyway hey baddie so it's your girl baby and listen if you don't know I had to interrupt what you were watching because I have to tell you there's a lot of y'all that are new to this channel and I have to put you on to game if your hair is thinning if you have thinner hair if your hair is shedding falling breaking you cannot figure out what's going on wash day sucks your ponytails are getting thicker thinner excuse me and your parts are widening listen you need to go not no you need to run not walk to the description 
description box and get your hands on the Hurst Grips Medicated Hair Growth Serums. My baddies have tried it and they spoke and they love it, okay? You cannot find this anywhere else. You can't get it at Target. You can't get it at Wally's World. You cannot get it at Ulta Sephora, Houston, Atlanta, Vegas. You cannot get it anywhere, okay? You can only get it at HurstGripsRx.com in the description box. Why? Because I have 10 plus years of experience in the healthcare and pharmaceutical industries. I understand drug formulations. I understand ingredients that are clinically proving to be effective, to work, to do the things that needs to be done. Your girl was diagnosed with androgenetic alopecia, AKA female pattern hair loss. And I struggled with thinning and my hair is like, I should have had it out, but listen, it's thriving. So if you want thriving hair, if you tried everything, you tired of wasting your money, that's it, that's it, that's it. <laughs> I am your angel. <laughs> I am your fairy, hairy godmother. Go down to the description box, girl, and, and boys and gals and everybody. Go down to the description box and get your hands on the Hurst Grips Medicated Hair Growth Serum. Don't let me say it again. So when you use hyaluronic acid, your hair is going to be less prone to breakage. So what that means is that your hair, you're going to be able to grow your hair. You're going to grow past your plateau. You're going to be able to retain length because the hydration through the hyaluronic acid is going to make it possible for your hair to stay so hydrated that it's going to grow, going to keep flourishing. Okay. And then of course, it's going to create a protective barrier on your scalp and it's just going to create a healthy environment for your hair follicles because wet follicles are happy follicles. I mean, y'all do with that what y'all want. I'm not entertaining this today. We not about to do this, okay? So, a nice overview, as I mentioned before. Why hyaluronic acid, right? One, because it's gonna keep your hair moisturized and it's gonna prevent dryness. It's going to strengthen your hair by reducing breakage and split ends. It's going to add beautiful shine to your hair. It's gonna create scalp health because it's maintaining a healthy environment, but a hydrated scalp, a hydrated anything, a wet scalp is a happy scalp, and of course, it works. It has scientific data to prove it. I just discussed that with you, right? So listen, and it's gonna manage your texture and it's gonna manage. So for those of you who are like, do you use a texturizer? No, I use hyaluronic acid. I am selling hyaluronic acid so much, you would think that I just have like a warehouse of hyaluronic acid, but I don't. And neither does anybody else. Why? Because it's very expensive to obtain. It's not easy to get your hands on. Until now, because there are drugstore brands that are hip to the game and that's adding hyaluronic acid to the ingredients okay so we're gonna go over a few we're not gonna go over them in detail i'm just gonna list i'm just gonna name them but the bottom line is this right if you're new to the channel go watch my garnier fruit teas filler dot 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 whatever the title is video because i'm telling you right now throw everything you got away that's all you need that is all you need that whole system now if you got curly hair i got the curly hair system with the hyaluronic acid that's the one that has hyaluronic acid and i'm not looking at my stuff so I'm gonna put it on the screen how much percentage but it got a good percent of hyaluronic acid and you want to have a good percentage of hyaluronic acid because I think you need like somewhere between two and five percent concentration for it to be effective and it has just that okay I heart that system so much that I'm scared to even like I don't even want people to be put on because I have no problems finding it right now and I don't want to have problems finding it and it's like so cheap like the whole like I think each product is under 10 bucks Listen, Garnier Fruitis, y'all did that. And of course they can, right? Because they're a multi-million dollar, possibly billion dollar company that can afford high level ingredients like hyaluronic acid. So when you find a moisturizing product, a deep conditioner, a hydrating, or even a strengthening mask these days, because now strengthening masks got hip and know that they have to balance it out with the right amount of hydration so that it doesn't, you know, that you're not prone to breakage or it doesn't dry your hair out. If you find products in the market with hyaluronic acid in them please grab them up immediately like especially with the percentages that I mentioned okay and I'm gonna confirm that I'm gonna put it on the screen just in case I'm wrong because I know there's a percentage but my mind is just not telling me what it is right now listen guys hyaluronic acid acts as a humectant attracting and retaining moisture this property helps hydrating the hair and scalp which can improve your hair and manageability okay there's an in vitro study on human hair follicles that showed that hyaluronic acid can increase the secretion of vascular endothelial growth factor or VEGF, which is a which is crucial for angiogenesis, which is formation of new blood vessels. If you don't know what angiogenesis is or you want um, more information on angiogenesis, please check out my video here that answers the question on angiogenesis. 
Uh, basically, this supports tissue growth and can potentially promote hair growth by improving the nutrient supply to hair follicles. So there's also a clinical trial involving hyaluronic acid injections combined with peptides, which if you don't know, I've already told you that peptides are smaller broken down components of proteins. Hair is made up of protein, specifically keratin. And so you want to fortify protein with more protein. So peptides is very, very powerful in all hair care. So you want to look for a protein. But anyway, when you combine these hyaluronic acid injections with peptides, it showed a significant improvement in hair density and thickness among participants with androgenetic alopecia, aka what I have, female pattern um, baldness, right? Or female pattern hair loss, if we want to be more politically correct. We definitely want to note that this is a study with hyaluronic acid in combination with peptides um, that kind of observed this effect and not necessarily hyaluronic acid alone. But I need you to know that all you literally have to do is combine peptides with hyaluronic acid to get this. And your girl can hook you up with that combination. Now, I mean, um, now this is definitely an injection but we're not going to go that deep, right? We're just going to talk about topical hyaluronic acid and topical peptides. All right. But anyway, that is something that I really need to highlight for you guys right now. All right. Anyway, so let's go into the, the products that you can find right now over the counter that has hyaluronic acid in them. Okay. So there's the L'Oreal Paris LV Hyaluronic Plump Hydrating Shampoo and Conditioner. As I mentioned, Garnier Fructis is the only thing that I'm really like, I heart right now. Their shampoo is dope. Their conditioner is dope. Their filler thing, they call a bond repair. It's not a bond repair, but it's a good strengthening uh, treatment. That's dope. The serum, the hyaluronic serum at the end, that's dope. And then the hyaluronic leave-in, the whole freaking serum. I don't mess with whole systems. I just don't because I can see past the BS. And remember, I could read labels, right? I understand formulation. So I know that there's really just one star product and then the rest of it is all just fluff, you know, so that they can sell more. But this whole system is dope, okay? And I hate that I'm selling it so much because they don't need my help and they're not paying me and I'm not getting no money from this, okay? But I, I'm just giving, I'm putting y'all on game. So there's the L'Oreal Paris L5 Hyaluronic Plump Hydrating Shampoo and Conditioner. There's the Ordinary hyaluronic acid 2% plus the B5 scalp serum. Now my recommendation is that you take the ordinary hyaluronic acid with the ordinary hair growth serum that has the multi-peptide, mix them together and put them on your scalp. Now you only got that tip if you stayed to this part of the video. If you didn't, that's on you. But next time you gonna watch my videos all the way through because I'm gonna drop gems at the end for those of y'all who just wanna hit it and quit it real quick. Not me, we don't do that over here. There's your Densifique Bind Density Shampoo. I'm gonna put the prices with everything on the screen. There's the OGX Hydrate and Repair Argan Oil and Morocco plus the Hyaluronic Acid Shampoo and there's Purology Hydrate Sheer Shampoo and Conditioner. Now I gave everybody with all different wallets and pockets and budgets different variety. But I'm just gonna tell you right now, I'm just gonna go with the Garnier Fructis because I love the whole system. It's affordable and it's affordable, but it's not cheap. You know what I mean? Like if you get it, you get it. So anyway, listen, I don't I don't think I need to say anything else. Like who can take hyaluronic acid? Who can get use it? Anybody who wants to improve their overall health and their hair hydration. That's it. If you got dry hair, brittle hair, if you got curly, frizzy hair, if you have aging hair, color treated hair, whatever kind of hair like you got, definitely color treated. Thin, thick, big, small, happy or tall, whatever kind of hair you got, you need to start including hyaluronic acid in your regimen. If you do not have hyaluronic acid in your hair care regimen, what is you doing? You're not hydrating your hair. I don't care what amount of shea butter. I don't care what amount of oils because oils are nourishing agents. That's another video, right? I don't care what amount of anything else you using and how much of it you using. Cause y'all think that the more you put on, the more it's gonna hydrate, child. No, hyaluronic acid is what you need in your hair care regimen. That's all I'ma say and I'ma leave it at that. All right, baddies. <laughs> Bye.